The third regional meeting of National Bioethics Committees of Eastern Mediterranean Arab States hosted by Sultan Qaboos University concluded. The meeting, organized with an aim to strengthen regional harmonization and cooperation among national bioethics committees in the region to address collectively emerging issues related to bioethics. It is an important international recognition for the country to be the hosting uh, country for this important domain uh, of bioethics. Bioethics in general is the field that mixes or merge the principles of ethics in biotechnology and its application in medicine, health, sciences and environment. Uh, this field of knowledge is highly needed, especially in this era where a lot of transformation is happening in, era, in science as well as in technology. We have already witnessed uh, COVID-19 pandemic and the challenges have, that people have faced and good amount of the challenges have been the ethical principles, how we can deal with pandemics while we do not violate the ethical uh, principles and social values. A set of priorities identified as a short to medium term operation strategy for regional cooperation in promoting bioethics, ethics of science and right to science was the outcome of the two days discussions among participant members. The main outcome is building capacity of the national bioethical committees as well as networking and collaboration. They will be working on case studies from the Arab region as well as from the Middle East. So these are important outcomes and we are looking for future collaboration as well with the UNESCO and WHO. A set also of recommendations for technical support, WHO and UNESCO, including capacity building activities were produced. We observe an important development in terms of technology, especially in artificial intelligence. So there are important questions that have been raised and we look for a definite answers on how we deal with artificial intelligence and how we can maintain the social values, human values and ethical principles while we enjoy the advantages of applying artificial intelligence. The contribution of Omani team has been well recognized and appraised by the regional uh, meeting members and from our side in Oman we will work on uh, put the action plans and recommendations into execution as well as we may try to make them applicable to the Omani situation. Deliberation amongst leading experts in ethics, digital technology, law, human rights and guidance of new technologies that use artificial intelligence hold great promise to improve diagnosis, treatment, health research and drug development and support governments carrying out public health functions. Hence, this kind of regional meeting and global cooperation among regional experts with the support of WHO and UNESCO do facilitate an unprecedented amount of information and data for the benefit of all. From Sultan Qaboos University, I'm Abdullah bin Ahmed al-Rubai, Sultanate of Oman Television.